from an Austin slaughterhouse has gone viral after being released by an animal rights group earlier today. Quality Pork Processors, or QPP, confirms the video was taken inside its plant, but the plant, which supplies exclusively to Hormel, says it follows proper procedures. ABC 6 News reporter Megan Stewart has those details. All was quiet outside Quality Pork Processors Incorporated Wednesday. But the chatter stemming from an undercover video taken of the facility's slaughter line is hard to silence. Well, consumers are absolutely outraged to see this footage. Uh, Facebook and Twitter has sort of exploded with feedback. We are choosing not to air any part of the graphic video. But these screenshots offer a glimpse of what it shows. The video was taken by an investigator working for the group Compassion Over Killing. According to the group's executive director, Erica Meyer, the investigator got a job at QPP with the intention of exposing inhumane practices. We also did document what we believe to be concerns for food safety as well, including pigs who uh, are covered in feces going through the slaughter process and the processing lines for human consumption, as well as pigs with pus filled abscesses all over them. The U.S. Department of Agriculture says some of the actions depicted in the video are completely unacceptable and it's investigating. Meanwhile, QPP says it has disciplined a worker in the video. Vice President Nate Jensen says QPP operates under some of the highest standards and procedures to ensure the food we produce is safe. Adding, we work closely with the USDA in ensuring we comply with and exceed all safety and quality standards. We're getting emails from people, comments on our YouTube video. And For Erica Meyer, these statements aren't enough. She says her organization will continue to follow up with the USDA's investigation. Because this high speed reduced inspection program is putting animals, consumers, and workers at risk. Megan Stewart, ABC 6 News. And again, we chose not to show the video. We felt it was just too graphic to air. If you do decide you want to see the video for yourself, you can find a link on our website at kaltv.com. Again, viewer discretion is advised.